Hey loves, it's raining, so I hope it's not too loud, but my name is Winnie Jean if you're new here and if you're returning, hey girl, how you doing? What was that? I just posted a video about the handmade locks that I made where I installed these handmade locks. If you haven't seen it yet, definitely go and check it out. I'll link it here. And if you have and you're wondering how the hell I got those out my head, this video is for you. It actually didn't take long at all. To be honest, I was procrastinating about taking my hair down, which didn't make any sense because it only took me about 30, 40 minutes to take down. It was actually one of the easier removals that I've ever done. And I didn't have to use scissors or anything like that. So it was like no chance I was gonna cut my hair which I did appreciate because that's not fun at all. So yeah, if you wanna know exactly how I took this style down, then let's go ahead and get into the video. You want a supermodel pose? I'm your real friend, Winnie. First things first, I had to figure it out for myself. So I went ahead and took out most of the locks by myself and I left four for me to go through and show you guys. Because the style is new, I literally just made it up. I had to figure everything out first. So I wasn't gonna have y'all out in these streets with me. So. First, you wanna grab the lock and just kinda look at it, see where you wrap the hair around because that's what we're gonna go ahead and start to remove. So I see that there's like a little like piece of hair that I wrapped around and I just grab that piece and I begin to kind of grab it and loosen it from the lock by twisting the lock in the opposite direction that it's wrapped in. And what that does is kind of helps to unwrap it. If you saw the video, you know what I'm talking about. So we're just unwrapping that piece that we use to cover up our hair um, and it takes a little bit of tugging. I wouldn't use scissors because it's really unnecessary, depending on how long you've had them in, but you can just kind of tug it, really pull on it. Um, be careful with your hair, of course, but you gotta get in there, sis, and kind of really separate that wrapping hair from the lock that we created. And once you do that, you should be able to grab your braid out of the lock. So I can see my braid and I kind of just pull it out and once I have my braid out, if there's any more hair going through the base of my braid, then I kind of just find that and slowly massage it until I can get it to come out. Honestly, it's super easy. You literally just undo what you did. So because we crocheted it through and then wrapped it around, you want to unwrap it first, then uncrochet it through. But you don't need a needle to do it. You simply just pull it out. So to take each lock down took me about a minute or two. It was not hard at all. I didn't even finish my show. What's that all about? If you want to reuse the locks, what I would do, just get one of like those little like plastic tubs that you would do like a water coloring or something like that in one of them little plastic storage tubs. Or you can even use one of those silver pans that you use for like turkey and stuff. Just get a big enough one to where it won't like overflow. But you wanna fill it up with warm water and then put in about a quarter of a cup to a third cup of apple cider vinegar and then let the hair sit for about an hour or two. After that, I'm gonna put warm water back in that tub with about a tablespoon of shampoo, whisk it around, let the hair sit in that for a bit. It'll clean up any residue and it'll also get rid of that apple cider vinegar smell. And then I will just let these babies air dry. It's not necessary to condition them because it's synthetic hair. Um, but maybe give them a little spray of rose water, maybe a little spray of perfume, something for a little fragrance moment, but you don't have to put conditioner in them. And then just reuse them. Hang them up, baby, put them in your closet. We spent too long making them to waste them. So yeah, um, but yeah, it's relatively simple. And this is my hair all taken down. And I just put it back into this ponytail because I'm about to pop a wig on. Y'all know what time it is. So yeah, I hope that you guys really enjoyed this video. A few of you guys asked for it in the comments and I wanted to go ahead and post it before I posted any new content, just you know, so you guys can have it. If you try the technique and you want to remove a video, here you are. And I hope that you guys really, really like it. Send me y'all recreations. I know you're going to try this style and I really want to see what it looks like. So send me your recreations on Instagram. Or you can tag me in them or DM them to me. I really want to see. I'm so excited. I know y'all about to kill them. And I love you. I'll see you in my next video. Bye, babes.